Okay. All right. Here we are with the Hyundai Veracruz 2011 SUV. We're going to change out this bad doorknob here and replace it with a new one. And it shouldn't take too long. Here we go. All right. First thing we do, there's a screw over here. There's actually one. There's a screw behind here, two, three, four, four screws, I believe. So there's a little cap on the end of this one that if you got a little screwdriver, you can take the cap off and then don't lose it, set it down. And then you can unscrew that screw. And then there's a little plastic grommet attached to it to make it look good. Set that down there. Then you got another screw. I'm gonna use the electric screwdriver because it's quicker. Screw right there, that's two. And then this one has a cap, which comes off pretty easy. And then this is number three. And then the next one, the fourth one, here's your door handle and there's a little fake cover. And the best way to get that cover off, if you can get in here closer, yeah. is just put your screwdriver behind it right here, and that kind of brings it out a little, and then put your screwdriver right there, and then the, the plate comes off, because it's just stuck in there. Get another shot. Yep. Okay. And then I'm going to get this fourth screw up. There you go. And then next we got the speaker here that needs to come out, and not sure the best way to get this, but just kind of, yeah, easily pry it off. Then you got a, a wire connecting it. I think you just push on this little tab and pull it apart, and then your speaker comes off. And that's so you can lift the door when that's off. Okay, then, take a screwdriver. Now you're gonna pry the door off and then lift it up. And there's little tabs behind there. You just gotta get it started so you can get your fingers behind there. You got this down? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh shit, try not to mess it up too bad. Okay, here it pop. Then you just, just kind of pop them off. Eight or so tabs or more. I think, I think I got everything. Oh, okay, one more, one more screw right inside the door. Yeah, the door. Uh -huh. Yep, there's a little rubber, a rubber grommet pops off there just for looks and then you take you get this fifth screw out so five screws and now it should just come right off and then and then you just lift it up but hold on to it because you got about no. well actually we don't even Okay, here's show this right here. Here's your two cables for the door lock and the door handle. There's a little tab here. That holds you just pull, pull on this tab, pull it, and then this separates. See that? Uh -huh. Two cables. Now, maybe I'll take this one tab off that goes to probably the door locks or something. Would you? Let's see how you do this here. Well, I have to edit this out, but uh, okay, we don't even need to do that necessarily because I'm just going to take off this door handle with one, two, three, four, five or so screws. And they're pretty easy to take off. Just pop them off one, two, three. Yep, and let's see, maybe four. You can see that screw there. And one more up top, or maybe two more up top. And one of them is flat. The screw head is flat, which I'll show you here. This one on the very top is flat, whereas the other one's around. 
Don't know why. Um, you ran out of screws. <laughs> Whoever assembled it. Yeah, that's uh, all it was. Hyundai ran out of screws. Okay, then it just pops off. See? And there's your screws down there. And you can just let that hang. It's not going to really hurt anything. And this is the broken one. See, there's a little uh, plastic piece broken off. And uh, yeah. I'm going to replace that in just a second. You can cut it off. Yeah. Um, that's 